Hi everyone, welcome to another video. Starship orbital test flight in March is getting closer and closer. This time, it looks like a real deal. The giant Liebherr crane has been positioned to lift Starship S-25 off the test stand at the suborbital pad A. Two road delay notices have been issued for today from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. and 10 p.m. to 1 a.m. Both S-25 and S-26 could make their way to the production site and bring S-24 to the launch site for the final pre-launch checkouts. Tiling works on Starship S-24 also seem to be finished and it will make its way to the launch site really soon. I can't wait to see this monster fly to space. Installation of the new shields on the outer ring of the orbital launch mount appears to be halted for unknown reasons. A few hours ago, Falcon 9 Booster 1078 and Dragon Endeavor were rolled out to Pad 39A ahead of its launch on Monday. The first stage booster for this mission will be on its maiden flight and will be recovered after launch. March is going to be such a cracking month for rocket lovers. Although Starship is about to steal the spotlight, another promising rocket is also going to make its debut flight in March. Maybe ahead of Starship, Relativity Space has now released a targeted date for the launch of its first ever orbital flight of its Terran 1 rocket, Good Luck Have Fun mission. The test flight mission is scheduled for launch on March 8 from Launch Complex 16 at Cape. If successful, Terran 1 will become the world's first 3D printed and methane powered rocket to fly. Relativity confirmed that they will proceed with the launch attempt without a static fire test before the flight. FAA has granted the launch license for this mission and teams at Relativity Space are hopeful for a successful mission. That is it for this short update video. I hope you guys liked it. Thank you for watching.